I'm Renu and I'm 14 years old. I lived in a beautiful village in a wetland dorm house. My father left my family when I was 7 years old. And my mother used to work in the nearby factory to look after my younger brother and me. I stayed with my grandmother after school until my mother returned from work. I loved to go to school. One day, an auntie who used to help us encouraged my mother to send me to work in a factory in Colombo for a big salary so that we could build a permanent house with a good roof. I left my home for the first time with the auntie to work in Colombo. She handed me over to a rich couple who took me to a house and sold me to different men. I tried to run away but I couldn't and I was helpless and I did not know where to get help. I was forced to do a lot of bad things which I hated to do. I escaped from that place. And now I'm in a safe house. Almost 4 years have passed and I still love to go back to my school. But nobody will take me back to school because of what happened to me. I miss my father, I miss my school, I miss my friends, and I miss my childhood. One in four victims subjected to human trafficking are children. They are often trafficked for commercial sex and domestic servitude. Globally, 99% of victims in the commercial sex industry are women and girls. More often, traffickers approach families in economically vulnerable conditions, offering false promises of work and a better life. Sri Lanka is not an exception to child trafficking. Let us join hands to end child trafficking in Sri Lanka. If you spot it, report it to the following numbers: National Child Protection Authority on one nine two nine, Police, Children and Women's Bureau on zero double one two triple four triple four. Or call IOM hotline on zero seven double six five double eight six double eight for further information and support.